Hello everyone, welcome to Senior Pablo TV. This is Senior Pablo. Today our topic is the common logarithm. A common logarithm is the logarithm with base 10 and is usually written in log or log base 10. So if you notice in our previous lesson, if we have log 5x, this is understood with base of 10. So that is equal to log 5 plus log x. That is our previous lesson. The laws of logarithm. Now, let us find out the common logarithm. So this is a very interesting lesson. So let's say we have log 1000, log 100, log 1, log 0, log 0 0.1, log 0 0.0001, log 0 0.0001. So if you're going to use your calculator, simplifying these problems is just clicking, or it's just very easy because you're just going to click in your calculator. But if we're going to expand the, con the connection of this common logarithm, you will enjoy the foundation of logarithm. Let's say we have this log 1000. We know that log 1000 is, 1000 is 10 raised to 3. So 10 raised to 3, that is 10 times 10 times 10. Log 100 is 10 squared. 10 times 10, that is 100. Log, this is 1, so that is 10 raised to, oh, we have a missing number here. So we're going to use log 10 here. So log 10 is equal to log 10 raised to 1. Log 10 is log 10 raised to 1. How about log 1? So that is log 10 raised to 0. Because, because any number except for 0, when you raise to 0, that is equal to 1. How about log 0? We're going to find out the value of log 0 later on using this calculator. Log 0 0.1. This is equal to log 10 raised to negative 1. Log 0 0.01. That is log 10 raised to negative 2. Two decimal places. And log 0 0.001. That is 10 raised to how many decimal places? Negative 3. So what will be our value? So we just write our logarithm into exponential form. So the value, if you're going to evaluate, is equal to their exponent. So we have 3, we have 2, we have 1, we have... We have 0, we have negative 1, we have negative 2, and we have negative 3. Okay, so let us check using the calculator. So, log 1000. Okay, that is 3. Log 100. That is 2. Log 10, which is 1. And log 1, log 1, that is 0. Okay. How about log 0? Log 0 will give us 
bat error. In our calculator, or also known as our undefined. Why? Following the laws of exponent, we cannot uh, undefined if we have zero raised to zero. We don't have uh, that is not real. That's why it is undefined. And log 0 0.1, that is negative 1. Log 0 0.01, which is negative 2. Negative 2. And log 0 0.001 which is negative three. Okay, so this is our common logarithm. So if your teacher will ask you, what is log 10,000? So log 10,000, log 10,000, 10,000, so that is equal to 10, log 10 raised to one, two, three, four, four. So that is equal to four log 100,000. So just count the number of zeros. 100,000, we have five zeros. So log 100,000, one, two, three, four, five is equal to five. That is the advantage of, of knowing the basic rules in mathematics. So our next lesson will be the anti-logarithm. Once again, thank you for watching Senior Pablo TV. And of course, kindly share this video to your classmate. And don't forget to subscribe in our channel. After the anti-logarithm, we have the logarithmic function and its graph. So kindly go to our playlist to check the sequences of our topic. And of course, we have our second channel, the Senior Pablo Tricks and Trivia. In that channel, we're going to discuss um, tricks or basic tricks, elementary tricks in about mathematics. So make sure that you subscribe in our channel, Senior Pablo Tricks and Trivia. Once again, this is Senior Pablo, and thank you for supporting and watching Senior Pablo TV. <laughs>